as a Minecraft roleplay lover, I thought it would be a blast to react to some of my friends' Minecraft roleplays. So today we are reacting to Enchanted Kiss by Nakesy. Very exciting. I am buddies with Nakesy as well as they were one of my co-writers for Darling Dormitory, a series coming soon to my channel. And so what a more fun thing to do than react to Enchanted Kiss. I'm excited. I think this will be a fun little time. Let's go on. Go, Let's go ahead and get into this. Ooh, headphones on. We're armed and ready, guys. I'm gonna be poking fun a little bit, but that's just because, okay, listen. This came out three years ago. Almost, yeah, three years ago. September 6th, 2020. My girlie has gotten a lot better at doing stiffs since this episode came out. And we'll actually be looking a little bit into that at the end of this deal, so stay tuned for that. We're gonna be looking at one of their newer things as well. But let's go ahead and get into Enchanted Kiss. Why not? So scenic. <laughs> well, for sale. 70... 70... 75,000 dollars?! I wanna move to this city! What the hell?! I wanna move to this city! Sign me up! $75,000 for a house? That sounds lovely! <laughs> 10 a.m. Marina's house! I got she snoozing. This peaceful sleeping beauty is me. Hi, my name is Marina, and this clip was taken moments before disaster struck. <sighs> Three, two, and one. We love the corny. I've done it myself. I'm guilty. Guilty as charged. Guilty as charged. We love the corny opening. We love a corny opening. <laughs> we love a... You're probably wondering how it got in this situation. Let me tell you. We love that. We love that. Imagine if that's how real people woke up. That'd be so funny. This clip was taken only more... I can't even speak. Hold on. <sighs> this clip was taken only moments before disaster struck. Three, two, one. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> I love it! I wish that's how we woke up in real life. That would be so funny. Oh my god. That would be so funny. Can we please- can that be a thing? Can we just make that a thing? Can that become our society? We wake up and it's just a movie intro. <laughs> Diana, you better have a good reason for calling me this early in the morning. Whoa! Calm down, Marina! I was just trying to give you a good morning phone call to wake you up on the big day! Okay. No hate to this VA, because I think I've heard their more recent stuff, and they've improved a lot. But the energy does not match. <laughs> the energy, just like, I don't think it was, like, made clear when they were doing stuff like the the director didn't Nancy didn't make it fully clear the vibe for the scene or maybe they wanted this vibe i don't know i'm not gonna judge everyone wants different types of vas but like they're in anime realm they're in like anime like voice acting which is great in anime um and then Nancy's in like voice acting in a like um almost like a video game intro which is very realistic voices wise um like a like a story based video game there's nothing wrong with the difference it's just such a contrast <laughs> it's great though i've i've had that i've had that in my own role plays i get that it all is about clarifying and sometimes that clarification just doesn't happen <laughs> and that's chill remind me to never stay up reading webtoon stories again it might have slipped my mind. Bestie same. <laughs> we love a webtoon. We love a webtoon. We love a webtoon in these woods. Okay. I'm hoping mom put me on the same floor as you, but I'm 100% sure she didn't. I asked her to do that three months ago, and I'm positive. Based on the title, I think we know what's gonna happen. I think we know. What's gonna happen? Positive. She forgot about Just it. Just hunch. I Just a girly a hunch. Look. They'll be lucky if I even do my hair. And you expect to land a boyfriend that way? How okay, listen. We in uni. Not everything revolves around having a boyfriend, okay? We can just be independent girlies. Boyfriend 
boyfriends, significant others in general, should always just come naturally. They should never be like a, and you expect to find a boyfriend like that? Child. Child. But I'll be honest, I thought this way at one point in my life, so I'm not blaming. I'm not blaming. <laughs> I thought this way when I was like 13, 14, 15. She got shit to say too. Hey, are you almost ready to go? Check-in ends at 9 tonight, and I'd rather get there before the crazies come out in the city. Almost done paying these bills. Then I'll be right with you. Did Dad send you anything? Like an email or text maybe? No, why? Did he seriously not text you good luck? Or even enjoy college? Ugh, he's gonna get it when I get a hold of him. Fuck that dad. <laughs> uh, no. Oh shit! Look at that! Oh shit! Akron University, baby! Uh, sorry, I think there's a mix-up. Did you register for a girl's dorm? Wait, there's two dorms? Oh, that's why there are two different options. You're kidding me, right? Hold on. <laughs> we hate when parents don't care. 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 Imagine! <laughs> You show up to uni. First of all, you're an adult if you're going to uni. You should also be looking at this stuff with your parent, right? With your parents, your guardian, or whatever, or just by yourself. How? <laughs> How? Plot. That's why. Because <laughs> it has to happen with the plot, obviously. Obvi this is a webtoon. This is a webtoon as a Minecraft roleplay. We literally, we are, we then knew. We then knew, and I'm not complaining. <laughs> Oh, um, mom, uh, did you, like, check the dorms, make sure I'm in the girls' dorm? Wait, there's two dorms? Um, yeah, no, they're not co-ed. They're, like, there's, like, a boys' and a girls' dorm. You gotta, like, make sure I'm in the right dorm, right? Like, can I see? Oh, no, 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 no. Like, that, no, there's two options, but it can't be for boys and girls. That'd just be stupid. Why would there be, <laughs> why would there be two options? And it means boys and girls' dorm. C can I, can I look at it? Can I check, can I, like, double check for, for you? Just... Just make sure. Do you not trust me? Do you not trust me? Do you not, do you not think I'm like smart enough to like know what, what dorm my own daughter is gonna be in? Do you really, do you really think I'm that dumb? Um, do, do you really? No. Do you really? No. Do you really? No. Do you really? No. Uh, what? Can, can I check? No. Okay. Guess your girl is getting pregnant first year of uni. Got it, got it. Parents in anime are like the same way as this, by the way. Parents in anime are like the same amount of stupidity and it's always so infuriating. It's always so, like Toradora, the parents in Toradora suck ass and it's so infuriating, but it's like plot. You know, it's like, it gotta happen. It's gotta happen for the plot. Your girlie knows it's gotta happen for the plot. You're kind of stuck in the male's dormitory for right now, sorry. There is absolutely no way for me to- Yes, Marina, there is absolutely no way for you to escape the hot men at this university. <laughs> you must sleep in the same dorm atore as the hot men. You have to. <laughs> it is the plot. <laughs> I'm sure you wouldn't mind, Marina, especially if there's some hot frat boys. Mother, I think you've done enough damage for today. Can you- <coughs> Please stop with the creepy comments. And I already have a boyfriend if you don't remember. Oh, you mean that good-for-nothing Carter? <laughs> This mom sucks dick, and not the good kind. I'm telling you that boy is going to cheat on you by next week. He's not good for you. Just break it off already. Okay, so here's a packet first off. And <laughs> the fucking receptionist girl fucking just sitting there like... Um, okay, so... <laughs> uh, 
Okay, uh, let me get your paperwork. <laughs> this song is copyrighted now, which is such a fucking sadness because it's so good. Wish that I feel what I can see. Enchant me. I don't know how much I'm actually going to be able to show this song, but it's really good. One sec, I need to go check. Hey, are you okay? You need to be more careful when you come flying out of your dorm like that. I'm so sorry. I wasn't looking where I was going, but thanks for breaking my fall. Now, as the Ari of this floor, I'm going to ask why you were in this dorm. It's a really, really long story. It really isn't. No! <laughs> my mom is dumb as shit and accidentally, like, put me as male on my deal for the college dorms. So here I am. Yeah, you're right. Thanks again for catching me, by the way. Leaves her door open. Anyone can come in. <laughs> it's going to turn out like one of those cheesy role plays you watch as a kid. When the girl on her first day of school runs into her future boyfriend. <laughs> that's such a good little callback. That's so funny. Oh my god, that's so funny. That's great. That is so good. This university looks freaking dope. I want to go here. <laughs> they want to see what a cute little cousin I have. <laughs> They're nah, cousins. That I'm makes super sense. Tired. A scream. And then the end of the episode. We love a good cliffhanger. We love a good cliffhanger. If you guys want to check out the rest of the series, please go check it out. Links down below. Go give them a like. Go comment down below that I sent you and that send in good vibes and good energy. That was so fun. It's so, okay. So we're actually going to look at Crimson Letters real quick because it's an episode zero from a role play, a newer role play of theirs. Um, and it really shows how far she has come with her role plays and I just kind of want to spotlight that real quick. Oh my god, so pretty. <laughs> Already so pretty. Oh my god, like the car. Never found you. Paths we live never crossed. And now my life is winding down. I feel the cinematics so pretty. Such good cinematics. I if our eyes will meet before mine close the voice actor's doing great. Props to you. The skins are so good in this series. And I don't normally like HG skins, but these are pretty good. <clears throat> I normally like Good evening, sir. Bit. What can I get for you? The Chevelle Blanc, please. Oh, he's a hottie. Right away, sir. He's a hottie. He's a hottie. Really Do they both the have split dyes? Wait, that's so I'm funny. Something big. Wait, okay, so she has yeah. split dye. They, oh my god, they both have split dyes. That's so cute. <laughs> split dye yeah. era. Yeah, no, the cinematics are already so much better. The voice acting is so much better. What do you need, Everett? If it's about the, the incident last so week, better. I already reported it and handled the media. No. And don't call me your son. <laughs> last time I checked, we didn't share the same blood, Everett. Come now. He's got... Daddy issues! <laughs> did he just throw his phone, or was that just a glitch? Or did he just put it away? I can't tell. Wait, hold on. <laughs> I have to know. <laughs> I have to know. And still thinks he can dictate... <laughs> okay, that no, he just put his phone away. <laughs> he can it's because I have a ring light in my face. It's hard to see dim lighting. It's toward me, but oh my God, he's a vibe. I could care less. He's a vibe. Now, Father, I think we have something important to discuss before Sylvester comes back. Our lives have always been intertwined. You just never cared to venture into mine. That you lost. Killed the that dream. The sets for this so good. Before it could happen. <laughs> Darling. You don't know how much I wish this was a reality we could- Hold on, hold on, sorry. This is for scientific research. <laughs> Darling, you don't know how much I wish this was a reality we could share. <laughs> reality isn't something you frequently live in, Sylvester. What makes you think this is any different? But- if they're not here, so can quickly turn into your face. I need to know what happens. You sound like my shrink, darling. God, even in my dreams, I can't escape his advice. Can we talk about something else? She's literally a manic pixie dream girl. Because he's manic. He's practically dreaming because he's so drunk. 
and Pixie. <laughs> I don't know, man. Just throw that in there. <laughs> so good. So good. Everyone go freaking check it out. So good. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Who should I react to next? I want to react to some other role plays. Um, I always ask permission first. So if I have no way of contacting them, um, that might be a little harder. But just let me know because I have been getting weirdly a lot more connections recently, which has been really cool. I've been meeting some really cool people in this space. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Comment down below. Love you guys.